Who is ready to open some Funko Fun Days mystery boxes? All right, so my last three Funko Fun Days mystery boxes arrived in the mail today, and I'm not exactly sure which mascots they are. I believe it's two Proto Pirates and one Crown Kraken, uh, but I have no clue. So let's open up this box and the other two down here, and uh, we'll get right to it. All right, so first things first, before opening these boxes, I have to say, I think Funko did an amazing job with the artwork on these boxes. I mean, look at that. The artwork is incredible. The pirate ship looks awesome. Uh, they teased us a little bit with a franny on there. We didn't get any frannies at Fun Days, but I, I mean, the artwork is great. I know you could pop these out, make a little display. So Funko, I think, did a really good job with these boxes, and uh, now I can't wait to get into them. All right, we got our first box here. I'm not sure, again, what it is. I'm going to reach, I'm going to try and get the things that everyone's getting in their boxes first. So let's get those first. Let's start with the biddies. So this is the Fantastic Voyage mascot biddies, the non-metallic version. All right, so not bad. There we go. Some biddies. Next, let's do the wobbler. Try not to look in the box. Don't want to spoil anything. All right, here we go. All right. And there we go. That is the online edition wobbler. It's Pirate Freddy and Proto. I actually think this Wobbler looks better than the metallic one they gave out at actual fun days. All right, not bad. So let's go with the soda first. All right, here we go. Soda. Okay, not bad. A 3,000 piece black and white Pirate Freddy Funko. I'll take that. I love this mold. I think he looks great. So, all right, starting off pretty good. That's a good soda. All right, first pop here. We got, okay, yep, there we go. So it was Proto Pirates. That is the first mascot. We got a Proto Pirates here. The non-flocked version. All right, so Proto Pirates box. So let's see what we get out of this one. All right, the first pop is, oh yeah, that's it. The glow in the dark Freddy Funko as Chucky. This is one I was hoping to get from Rugrats. Love this. Love that show. This is just, this is a great pop. It's going to go great in my collection. I'll put it right next to the Freddy Funko NFT royalty where he's dressed up as Reptar. This is awesome hit. Perfect. All right. And our last pop is, all right, another 1500 piece. Freddy Funko as Frodo from Lord of the Rings. I know this one was kind of sought after. So, all right. Not a bad box to start. I'll take it. And now we got box number two. So I'm not going to take out the biddies or the wobbler because we know what they are. They're the same and everything. But we will start with the soda, which is... Okay. I really don't like these colored ones. They, they kind of look weird to me. But a 5,000-piece red proto pirate. I mean, all right. This will probably be up for trade or... Or something. I'll bring it to one of the shows. Alright, so first pop. If if the mascot's in the same spot as the last time. And it'll be... Alright, Crown Krakens. There we go. That is a Crown Kraken mascot. The non-glow one. If you've seen the glow one at the actual fun days, the glow is amazing. I'll throw up a picture on screen. Alright, first pop. It's... A 5,000 piece Freddy Funko as Western Ken. All right, I mean, not something I collect, so this will also be up for trade or at one of the shows. This is not the 100 piece metallic version, uh, but all right. And our last pop for this box is... Okay, all right. This is the Freddy Funko as the Penguin. I already have one of these, so again, this will be up for trade or for sale. But honestly, I think this mold is really good. I like the pudgy Freddy Funko. So, all right, I'll take it. And now our last and final box. Again, I'm not going to take out the biddies or the wobbler. So we'll start with the soda. And the soda is a 3000 piece black and white Pirate Freddy again. All right. So now we have one to keep and one to trade. The first pop, I'm going to say the mascot's probably in the same spot. And we got, yes, another Proto Pirates. There we go. And we'll do pop number one is, all right, a 3,000 piece 
Freddy Funko as Morty for all you Rick and Morty collectors out there. This one, not for me, but I actually think this is a really good mold. He's holding little Rick. I like that. Um, so this is a solid pop. And finally, the last one. All right. Okay. I'll take that. 1500 piece. Freddy Funko as Marvin the Martian. I like that. Uh, I was hoping to get the metallic one, uh, so I'll be on the lookout for that as well, but this will definitely hold me over. This is an awesome pop. Love the mold. Love Marvin the Martian, so... All right, I'll take that. All right, so not a bad opening overall with all the boxes. Uh, I definitely got two pops here that are going to stay in the personal collection. Definitely love those. The rest I'll have up for trade or for sale at one of my next shows. I also want to give a huge thank you to Slapshot Pops for sending some of you guys over here. If you haven't already, go check out his channel and enter his giveaway for the Funko Fun Days Pirate Freddy. Uh, really grateful for him and, and everything he does for the community. So just, again, want to give him a, a huge shout out and thank you for sending some of you guys over here. And again, enter his giveaway if you haven't yet. Definitely enjoyed opening these mystery boxes. Can't wait for the ones I do for New York Comic Con. Uh, but don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you don't want to miss any future videos like this going forward. I appreciate you guys watching. Hope you enjoyed. And as always, thanks for watching.